and a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. I'm very excited to be able to bring you live action from Major League Soccer coming right up. It's the New York Red Bulls, and they take on the Columbus Crew. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough for the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. Thank you for joining us. Now get ready for a great match. And now they get the ball rolling. Amaya. Cáceres Jr. Vonzeir. Oh, it might be! And the keeper throws himself at the ball. But he's gone short with it, delivering it into the box. Well, no real accuracy, and easy for the keeper. Darlington Nagby read it well. Luis Diaz. Just the challenge that was required. Vonzeir. Luquinhas. Now this could be productive. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Darlington Nagby. And given away. And still they wait for the chance. Could be! The crossbar got in the way! Well, no danger now. Well, that was a bit unlucky, because you just get the feeling they need to make the most of one of these chances. Luquinhas. Making progress. Well, simply couldn't beat the first defender. Well, those stats tell you everything. A tight and cagey game without enough goal mouth action. Both teams need to get more players forward if they're to pose a real threat. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Omia Fernandez. Disappointing pass. Williams, intense pressure, opportunity it is, oh that is a goal from long range, he won't soon forget, 
absolutely right out of the top drawer. Well, look at the replay here, because they don't come much better than this. He hits it so sweetly. What a goal this is. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Lucas Zelarayan. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. That is that for the first half here. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half, scoring that late goal, but I thought his overall contribution was really good, and he got better as the half wore on. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Omir Fernandez. A foul, but advantage played. Bonzer. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Nagby using his physical strength to shield it time for a change then going well Well, this would help them get back into the game. In it goes to reduce the deficit. Still very much alive and kicking. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. As they kick off again 2-1 the current state of affairs Frankie Amaya well as you can see the hosts have had much less of the ball but their counter-attacking has been really good particularly in the wide areas it's been an excellent performance from them so far yes really good without the ball and the all-around performance levels have been high And space to cross it. He read the cross, but now must clatter it clear. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. An effective ball. Omir Fernandez. It'll be a corner. So two substitutes to come on in one go.
Corner kick played in. Now that was never likely to trouble the keeper. Reyes. He's showing good defensive judgment. Not a great challenge. Free kick here. Delivered into the box. In it goes to increase their advantage. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them? Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Five minutes left. The tackle completely missed time, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Bonzer. It is a decent looking attack here. Great opportunity. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat trick. Well, this is a very good finish. He just does enough to get it over the keeper. He'll certainly be pleased with that. Goals in plentiful supply, 4-1 currently. Darlington Nagby. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening, and they played really well. What a performance that was today.